Hi, my name is Andre and this is what my beautiful hometown of Cologne, Germany looks like on a clear autumn night. We have clear skies and a gorgeous moon up here. So let's say for some crazy reason we want this moon to cast a lens flare onto the scene. Of course we're gonna head over to the filter menu, render filter, lens flare and I don't want this to be too bright so I'm gonna decrease the brightness to about 50%. I'm gonna choose a 35mm prime lens and now I'll have to position this right where the moon is. I'm gonna hit OK. And oh, I was off quite a bit. Because it's quite tricky to position this correctly in the small preview window, so I'm gonna show you an alternative method. Um, we head over to the window menu and we open up the info panel. And here we have coordinates for X and Y. Keep looking at this area while I zoom in on the moon and choose the eyedropper tool. And now if I hover over the center of the moon here, you can see we get coordinates for this correct center. And we can, of course, note those down on a notepad, which I already did in advance. And I'm gonna go back to the filter, render filter, lens flare. And now prepare to be amazed. Here's a real hidden gem inside Photoshop. If you hit the old key and click on the image, you're gonna get a new um, option which is the precise flare center and I'm gonna just copy over those coordinates into my dialog here. I'm gonna click OK and there you go. Now our lens flare is exactly in the center of the moon and this is how you precisely position your lens flares. Enjoy!